hello people welcome to my youtube channel in this video we are going to discuss two important tool of LTM designer so uh, we all know that like uh, in lot of calculation we always needed a track length right so uh, let's talk about this Saturn PCB toolkit so there are two tools on this tool uh, Saturn PCB tool where we you need to put the the track length right as you can see here so here we uh, in this tab we calculate the amount of current which can flow through the track so here it is 1.5 amps so here we have to put the track length to measure the amount of current right similarly if we need to calculate the cross talk between the conductors so uh, yeah so here also we need to place the coupled length between the conductors right so I'm just going to show you there are two methods the one is manual method by using that you can calculate the track length and there is an automatic method where you have to just select the net and it will tell you the uh, the track length the total track length from pad to pad right but before going further if you guys want to win a five dollar coupon right now just follow this procedure what you guys need to do just go to the description of this video and there will find a link uh, free five dollar registration link and you have to just left click on that link it will direct you to next pcb website there you have to register yourself with your official mail id and sign up for uh, the next pcb.com and there you will find a coupon under my coupon section which will give you a five dollar flat discount on your any pcb you order so let's start the video so here you can see uh, there is a 5 volt track so i'm just pressing control and left click on the tab it will highlight the uh, this particular net right so i'm just going to measure the total length of this track so for that what i'll use i'll use a tool control m so if you press the control m you can see a plus cursor on your uh, mouse position right so you have to click at the center of the tab pad but we have to measure the total length including pad so we'll click here and don't release the click just drag it to where till where you want to measure so i just want to measure here that's it then start from here to here then here to this side click and drag left click and drag left click and drag so this is the manual method by using that you can calculate the approx length um, like plus minus um, like plus minus 0.1 mm or 0.2 mm and that's it okay now right click and hold the control and left click here right and you can see we measured these parameters right now we'll open the calculator normal calculator remove remove all these previous calculations so this this is the first first length 2.27 plus the another length is 0 0.8 plus another length is this uh, xy direction 0 0.6 plus 1.14 this is 1.14 one six another length is six point six six three six next is this xy direction it is point eight next is five point three three another one is 1.9 and the next is 3.30 3.302 equal so it's around 23.9 now i'm just going to show you how you can measure the um, length automatically right? i mean you do need, don't need to do any uh, manual measurement right so uh, but before that i'm just going to sh show you uh, but yeah we, we can uh, try this first then i'll tell you one more tool so here uh, you have to go to the panel and select the PCB right and in the PCB you have to select the nets click on all nets now you have to click on the 5 volt this one right and if you uh, just 
extend this so here you can see the routed length is 23.4492 mm uh, for this 5 volt track and what we have calculated was 23.9 so this is one more method that you can use to calculate the length right so here you can see i'm just going to tell you one more tool so uh, these are all the lengths here right and if you do all the operation any operation on the pcb these length uh, uh, tags will be still there right so i'm just going to show you how you can remove those tags so for that you have to uh, press the shift and c and all the tracks will be gone right so uh, here we have completed this uh, tips and uh, in the next tutorial we're going to discuss about uh, how to add colors with your schematic so we can easily identify the tracks which we need to route or which we don't need to route and like we can plan our uh, routing thing thank you